All right, we're gonna get some U by Kotex again. <laughs> that price at $3.14. So picking up two is gonna be $6.28. I bought this one to give us back $2. Some of you guys may have a dollar and fifty rebate as well. I only have the two dollar rebate, which is all good. And we're gonna submit to coupons.com for four dollars. So that's a total of six dollars, leaving my final cost to be 28 cents for two boxes. So I'm gonna grab them. Now I'm gonna pick up these ad bill right here. 18 count they're priced at four dollars and 28 cent um i bought it's gonna give us like a dollar and 50 cent and shopkick is giving back 660 kicks between the scan kicks and the first um purchase kicks okay so that's gonna bring my final cost to be 14 cent for the box so i'm gonna grab it now the bio team is priced at six dollars and 57 cent i'm gonna use this printable coupon that i printed from their website for a dollar um, I bought it, it's giving back, what's that, $2.50. So it's gonna take off a total of $3.50, leaving my final cost to be $3.07. I really wanna get this for my grandmother. I uh, mentioned before how, you know, she recently told me how she her mouth was dry due to the medicine she's taking. So I'm trying to get her a little stockpile of different options. So this was something that I um, wanted to pick up. So I'm picking it up. Okay, this is a clearance area. I've showed you guys this area before. Look like they cleaning it out. They used to have big old buckets of um, makeup here. Um, here's the makeup selection they have. It's still pretty expensive. Um, we do have rebates for uh, Maybelline, but this six dollars, so this is gonna stay right there. But yeah, this is not the store that got everything like super cheap. <laughs> The other store, other Walmart I, I sometimes go to, they probably will have some Maybelline for $2. I'm not sure if there will be any mascara eye makeup, but I know for sure they got the foundation for $2. And this is the L'Oreal hair color for 6 Okay. Hey, huh, this is still priced too high. But I did find this for $3. And I remember previously I showed you guys this and it was still like $7. But I'm happy to get it for three because I'm gonna say this for my baby. Yeah, so now I'm gonna pick up this Clorox foam right here. This refill is priced at four dollars and ninety-eight cent. I bought it's gonna give us back two dollars. And Shopkick is giving back five hundred and thirty-five kicks between the scan kicks and the purchase kicks. Um, which is two dollars and fourteen cents. So that's a total of four dollars and fourteen cent, making this only eighty-four cent. Now I do have a rebate on um swag bucks i'm gonna try to submit to but i'm just praying it don't disappear before i walk out the store so um if we are able to submit to that i think it's i think it was a hundred swag bucks I'll, I'll put it on the screen right here okay i'm also gonna pick up some of this toilet bowl cleaner right here for two dollars and 68 cent and i bought us giving back 75 cent now purchasing both of these items i should hit a bonus of a dollar okay so that's why I'm really getting this. I love toilet bowl cleaner. I love to be able to get toilet bowl cleaner and cause I'm gonna keep this for my house. I don't even sell it. I keep it for my house. So yeah, I'm gonna pick up some of this as well. Alrighty, they they giving us this mail again free. So I'm gonna go ahead and get it again. It's $4.98. I bought it and give it back $4.98, making it completely free. And I can't wait to fry up a chicken sandwich so I can, um, you know what, I might just, I can't wait to try it out basically. I'm gonna just say that. I don't know if I'm gonna just buy some already um, <laughs> cooked chicken sandwiches and just add the sauce or if I'm gonna go through the um, steps of, you know, frying up some chicken myself and putting it on there. So we're gonna get some more of these Keebler cookies. The deal is sweet, so why not? They're priced at $2.48, so we're gonna get two packs. That's gonna bring my total to $5, $4.98. Swagbucks is giving back 300 Swagbucks, which is $3. And Checkout 51 is giving back 62 cents for each pack, so that's $1.24, okay? So that's $4.24 for two packs, okay? Leaving my final cost to be, what's that? 70 cent for two packs of cookies? Yes, no brainer, so I absolutely I'm getting them. Now, these are the items that I picked up. Now, I only needed a total of eight rebates to hit my, hit my bonus of $3, okay? So, I didn't go overboard. <laughs> so, for everything you see here, I paid a total of $33.73. Here are both of my receipts, okay? I did two different transactions, you see here. That dollar coupon for the bio team had to be manually entered in. It did not scan, okay? 
So keep that in mind if you do decide to print it out. So again, I paid $33.73 for everything you see here, okay? Now, I submitted my receipt to Ibotta, okay? And I received back a total of $17.83, which included my weekend warrior bonus of $3, my Clorox cleaning bonus of $1, okay? $17.83, okay? Now, um, swag bucks, 300 swag bucks for the Keebler cookies, which is $3, and 100 swag bucks for the Clorox disinfectant that I picked up. I got 100, which is a dollar for that. Shop kick, still processing, but 1,200 and um, 20 kicks, which is $4.88. Check out 51 for a dollar and 24 cent. Okay. 62 cent for each one of the packs of cookies and coupons, not uh, coupons.com, but um, shop mail. I submitted for four dollars for the you buy Kotex. So that gave me a grand total of $31.95 back in rebates. Okay. Now subtracting the total amount spent from the total amount received back makes everything you see here a dollar and 78 cent. Is all good, okay? <laughs> I'm glad I got that Clorox and that Biotene. So, yes, this is still a win-win for me. Um, it's not a lot. Um, I didn't go overboard. I didn't see a lot of clearance items. I only went to um, I went to one store actually. Um, if yeah, I didn't you know circle around the, <laughs> the city of Houston today. Now, when I was checking the Brand Club app, I do have surveys for Kimberly Clark for any pads, but I didn't see the liners. I didn't see any of the liner, the liners that qualify for these um, survey rewards. But keep that in mind if you head to the store. So if you, you know, if you don't want to pick up the liners, if you do want to pick up the pads, if you do have Brand Club, check out Brand Club. I know we haven't used it in a long, 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 long time, but they have surveys on there, so that can even better lower your out of pocket and hopefully you also have the dollar 50 i bought a rebate okay if i had the dollar 50 rebate you know i probably would have at least picked up one pack of pads that was a little more um you know instead of two packs of the liners we always get the liners but i like to pick up the pads also because my neighbor she's a um, young teenager like 13 or 14 years old and i'm not comfortable giving young kids the other thing that the the um tampons i just you know i strictly just give her the pads or whatever but that's probably too much information <laughs> but however i'm just saying all this to say that if you have brand club check your brand club surveys i know it's been a while since we used that app but it's still current so check it out and, and whatever and see if you have any rebates available any um survey rewards available i should say but yes, this is everything that I picked up. Now, if you have every, any questions regarding the items, the couple of handful of items that you see in my basket, please do not hesitate to leave a comment below. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate your support. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. All right, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.